Hey everyone. So as I promised, I was supposed to make the permanent version of my guitar preamplifier using transistors. Uh, after a couple of days, I was able to make a rather noiseless version of the preamplifier. So I'll be using the homemade. Uh, Amplifier, mono amplifier to amplify the uh, output signal from my preamplifier. So let's have a closer look. It's the preamp. I had to make a couple of modifications because of which it looks a little crappy, but still it does the job. The is the output. So uh, yeah, I didn't had a quarter inch mono jack, and it's from no, the input. So I used the regular 3.5 inch, uh, 3.5 millimeter. Sorry for that. Uh, headphone jack and socket, and it does the job pretty well. Let's say. So let's power it up. Now this stays on power. Now if I touch the ground, you can hear a buzzing sound. That's the problem. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have a guitar, so I'll improvise. Please bear with me. So to test the circuit, here's what we'll be using. Yeah, a uh, tin can with a rubber band. Uh, it's the poor man's testing equipment. I'm not sure if you can hear it or not. Well, that's how it sounds if you are able to hear it without the amplifier. Now, we'll attach it at the back of the base. There's a feedback because the circuit is just very sensitive. I'll decrease the volume to avoid feedback. Now. Maybe you can hear it as well. It is loud. very clean and overall there are uh, no issues in particular the pre-amplifier considering it to be a home built amplifier is also good especially because it's very simple uh, well that's it uh, I'll try to share the schematics, the final schematics that have all the modifications to get the maximum gain. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you like it. Yeah, that's all. And do subscribe if you want to be updated about uh, the upcoming videos. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Bye bye.